What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. All right guys, as promised, I said I would do a video for Saturday today as well. What I said I was going to do is I was actually going to take a couple photos that you guys sent me through my Facebook page. You know, um, if I find something really awesome, I'm going to share it with the uh, rest of the community, right? So keep showing me those things. You guys can go right to my page here, um, right here, Mars Anomalies and Beyond. Now, what will happen is you'll send me it. It won't go on the main page. It's for me to see first. A lot of you guys would just post on there. Hey, Chris, you know, you're just doing great work. I appreciate your work you're doing. Keep up the great work. So, and, and that's much appreciated, guys. And a lot of times you guys will say, hey, Chris, I got some photos. Would you check them out for me? You know, again, like I said in my last video, I'm honest. You know, I'm going to tell you, listen, I, I can't make out what that is. There's not, there's not enough detail or any of that sort. Now, if you guys have something phenomenal that comes up, I will share it with the rest of the community. There's no doubt about it. So you guys can always uh, send it to my uh, Mars Anomalies page and beyond. Now, I haven't updated this page, and I'm going to, uh, just in case anything happens to YouTube. And any of you guys that have Facebook, you can check out the page, and uh, you, know, uh, you can actually see the videos on there as well. So just keep an eye on that. And I'll be putting extra stuff on there, which I said I was going to do a while back, but I got caught up in everything. It's tough to keep up with it at the time, but now I'll be able to do it. So uh, definitely uh, be doing this stuff, you guys. All right, let's get into this because here's here's one that's pretty cool. This is Copernicus Crater, and you guys know this. You've seen this a million times. Um, I find it a little weird, and, and I've seen this photo before, but when I see a couple things, like here's a good example. Um these I highlighted these areas right here. There's a couple of my I highlighted. Now I'm not going to use the Windows Viewer because it always looks like crap. Let me go right to Photoshop. It's a hair bit better. Um, I've seen this anomaly here, and it looked like some kind of weird. See the way that has this back to it like this here. Uh, this is what I'm seeing now. It may be just trick of light, and I'd be okay with that. Goes up like this here. Goes across. This appears to be coming up like this. And we got two black things on the top there. See that? They're like darker pieces. It goes like this. Goes down, falls down in the front here. Well, it looks like some kind of rectangular opening. Goes up like this. And it has these two divided, almost like windows type, type thing. You guys see that? That's what I'm seeing in this when I look at that. But even if I was like, okay, trick of light, you know, I'm okay with that too. Now there's a lot being hidden in this photo, guys. It's just, it's crazy. But yeah, you're going to see more in a minute. Now, these are what I just don't understand. I'm looking at these and I'm saying, why do these look like these rectangular openings uh, here in the crater? You guys see all that? I see one on this side. Okay. Now, again, these could be tricks of light. And I, again, I'd be okay with that too. But look, look at this. Something right here going down like this with a smaller piece right there. Something right there doing that. But check them out. There's multiple things doing this. Especially this one here going across. Now, of course, that's not clean. But notice this other piece also coming out. Again, being manipulated. So you're only going to see bits and pieces. And I wish we could see the whole thing. And I know you guys have shared your frustration and said the same. This goes down. Goes like this. Goes like this across. Goes up like this. What the hell is that, guys? Also, take note of the bottom ones. Now, if this is merely, you know... Uh, Shadows, I'm not going to lose sleep over it. That's fine. But it just seemed a little strange how they all happened to be in the same area, facing the same direction, same kind of shadows. Is it just merely coincidence? Good possibility. I don't see it that way. I see it as something else more than that because when you look at the side of this, it looks like it has these weird pieces or something on it. See that? On the side of that. What could that possibly be? And look at the objects in the background. Okay. Pretty cool, right? Now, that that in itself is pretty cool, but you haven't seen nothing yet. Let's jump out of that. Let me jump into this photo. Now, this is an up-close part of it, and you can see the crater wall right here. Okay. Now, I'm going to show you this. This is pretty clear, so we don't have to go into Photoshop. Um, notice this area right here. See this piece going like this? It's round, coming over like this here, and going like that, right? Back out. Now, there are several lines. You can see the line going across here at the top. And I think we have several of these because these are basically in strips, guys. Keep in mind, these are in strips. And a lot of times, that's what it did, and they just stitched them together. They put some, there's some going across, but most of them, you can see right here. Here's another one going across. You can see right here, there's another one. 
and they put it pretty much stitched all these together. Okay, so what I do is I enhance all this. So this is going to look like a kind of this weird bridge thing going on, but you'll see what I mean in a minute. That's not what I'm so much seeing in the photo. What I'm seeing is there's something right here. Yeah, goes like this over here. This whole thing has been made to look almost flat. Now, it's like these objects right here. There's one here and another one on this side in the middle. And look at them. They're underneath the manipulation, but you can see them. I'm going to just back out. You guys use your magnifiers, and you can see that. There's something right here. This is cool because this doesn't even, I don't even think they've even seen this, to be truthful with you. Um, check this out. This is cool. Right here, can you guys see this, what looks like a dark gray item with a round black circle, and then this round piece right here? You see that? I'm looking at it, I can look at it right now on my magnifier, and I'm going, what the hell is that? Hidden in the darkness, sitting right there. But, that's not the only thing. Now, I'm going to enhance this thing just to show you. Now, just before I do that, check this out. There's what, like these little lines, there's something going down like this, going over here. And what I do is I took any line that was here and just darkened it up. Again, right here. Going across, back down. Now, this may be just a manipulation, because it's pretty large. You can see it. But these objects have been, it's been made to look like just flat. Almost like, well, not really flat, but like blended all together. When in actuality, there's individual pieces laying all over this area. Look at this area right here. Something right here. What has this white piece sticking out that hasn't been covered. See it? See the manipulation going around it? Okay. Let me show you, because this is pretty cool. Something right there. This item right here. Look at the way this thing has this line. It stops right here and it goes back down. See this? Almost looks like some kind of craft on its side. Is it or is it not? Let's enhance the photo and find out. Okay. Now, this is what I come up with. Check this stuff out. What the hell? Now, let me go back show you this stuff again we've got this piece right here but all of these pieces these lines and all of these little intricate pieces all the lines have been brought out to give you this this is what we got guys what the hell is that see this is that piece went like this and around well there was an actual line there and by using the, the burn tool we can bring these lines out and pop this stuff out and again, this looked like some kind of weird bridge thing. It's not. It's it's an actual line like you got up here. See this right here? And again, these are stitch lines. That's all these are. And you can see them all over the photo right there. So that's not nothing. That's so disregard that. But these objects, there's something laying right here. Right there. This object right here. And check these things out, man. What the hell? There's objects inside this manipulation that's put all over the whole back of this. I mean, just look at this. Pretty decent detail right here in the crater. Outside completely mush. Why? Look at it. You can tell it's been doctored, man. Pretty decent detail down here. It looks pretty good, except for this right down here. I just noticed that. It's like a square piece right here. See that? And there's something gray going down like this. But anyway, check that out. What do you think that is, guys? Look. Pretty decent detail. Completely mush at the top. I wonder why. There you go. Here you go objects inside this manipulation it's being like like a cover like almost like a sheet put over it like it's been washed out and check that out here's that other object i was just telling you guys about you can see that right there what the hell is this stuff i'm going to back out you guys can use your magnifiers and see that and again we've got these pieces up here now i'm going to go ahead and pause it if you need to and i'm going to jump over to the original one again and check it out those lines those objects are right there see it right there there's a right there line round piece okay you got to get underneath the actual the washout you got to get underneath that again we got something that's right here crazy stuff here guys again i'm going to look at it with my magnifying glass and oh my god it looks like a, a, a city some kind of moon base or whatever the hell this may be with objects sitting all over this thing. I can see this myself and I'm just like, I'm totally at awe here going, what the hell is this? Shit? And to me, this is absolutely right there. It's right there in the front of our face. And again, there it is. Now, 
we're going to look at this photo here. It said, you need to check this out because this is basically cities. And I'm saying, well, all right. Now, this white stuff right here, this is a bunch of crap. See that? That's not real. Uh, you can see it's been fudged in there. You can just see it's been... And look at it. Come on. You got decent detail here. All of a sudden, complete crap. It looks like... It looks like cotton candy all over the damn thing, to be honest with you. But check this out. What is this right here in this crater coming down? Right? How about this right here? Look at the lines. Again, the lines tell all because sometimes when they use their manipulation, they don't cover the actual edges or the edges still come through. Look at this. Here. Goes around. Stops. There's another piece right here. Goes like this. Goes back down. And we got the other side of it right here. Just lower. Right there. And it looks like there's something sticking up, but you can't quite make that out. And, of course, you guys can use your magnifiers right now. I'm going to go back a little bit more so it'll be a little clearer on your side. And then we're going to move over to this one here. Check this out. Look at the way these things are. Pieces sprawling out from the sides of this thing. And there's something been blocked right here. I don't know if you guys can see this. Right here, there's a line going down, going across, going over here. It's whiter anyway. Like they've been trying to take out the rest of whatever the hell these things are. Look at this. Almost like a perfect hole in the ground. With something else right there. What could that possibly be? Okay. Now this this photo's been really been screwed with bad. I mean, really bad. Now let's look at the enhanced one. Okay. Now this is what I did. I drew the lines back in to try to thicken them up. There it is. Each of the craters. Upper left. Okay. I just kind of drew this in. You can see that right there. We can see the line right there, and I just kind of went off a little bit. It wasn't completely straight. You can see that. And again, we can see it right here. Right there. Come back down. You get the smaller one right here. It's dark. It kind of curves right here. Comes back down right here. And what looks like this thing right here actually goes like this, really. So, yeah. What could stuff be, guys? Now, I try to burn through this crap. There's just no way around it. But you can see individuality. See these pieces? You can see the edges? But there's no way to see what those are. There's just no way. Been completely taken out and covered over. But these objects, there's things inside these, these craters. And they're there. No doubt about it. Now, what I do is I, I did a side-by-side -side on these. So you can have a look at these. And check that out. Pause it anywhere you like. Have a look at each side. Tell me what you think. All right. This person here was went by Sib Sibby. Uh, thank you very much for submitting those, Sib Sibby. All right. Now I want to show you guys a photo from Keith Murdoch. He sent it in. Thank you, uh, Keith, for doing that. Uh, I told him I would probably uh, feature his uh, photo here. Now, this is an anomaly he found. And, you know, I, I enhanced it and found something slightly different as well. Check this out. Now, it makes you wonder if this is like hieroglyphs or some kind of thing in the rock. Now, when you look at it, you go, eh, I'm not really seeing much of anything. Well, you can. When you see this thing go down, comes up, 90 degree angle, and you can see this perfect, nice, clean line by itself. See it? There's a line right there, perfectly straight. This, I mean, this isn't natural. See that? What the hell is that? It's almost like this weird, like, animal. You can see, like, the head to it. See it? Goes down, goes over like this, goes back up, almost like a cow head or something like it looking right at you like if, if there was two eyes right here. Um, but anyway, it's got this line. You can see it just faint. It's right there. And then you got these optics right here. Or these, is it a hieroglyph? Is it a some kind of drawing, uh, etching? What is it? I think that's pretty cool. What I also noticed was this at the bottom. Look at this right here. It goes down like this, stops here in the corner, goes across, and goes back up. You can just see it. See that right there? Comes down like this here, stops, goes straight across, and it looks like it goes back up. What the hell is that? Is that natural, or is that something more, guys? I think it's something more than that. Notice how these rocks. See that? You can see nice detail in this rock. Pretty decent. Completely fudged out. Completely taken right out of there. See that? You got something in the background right here. I notice it's got like this black little spots there. Of course, there's no way to make that out, but check this out. Looks like this flat piece coming out. And then has this piece holding it up. See it? What is that? Look at this piece coming straight up. Looks like it does. It's this thick. Goes up like this and it has this piece sticking out. What do you suppose that is? Doesn't make any sense, does it? It may be part of this other piece right here. This brownish piece. I don't know. 
You got this piece over here. You can see what looks like layer. Another one right here. See these grooves? These don't look natural here, guys. Look at that. One, two, three. And, of course, you can see this has been completely ma manipulated out. There's almost virtually no detail compared to over here. Completely been taken out. But you can see, like, straight pieces coming out of that. Almost like something was there and they covered that up. Anyway, let me show you my enhancement. This, this is what I got out of this photo, guys. And again, you can see this. It's almost like, let me just see if it does this thing right here. You can see the way this rock, it goes like this, right? And goes up and over. You guys see that where it goes like this? Boom, up and over. Well, the actual raised part of this, whether it's some kind of uh, carving or something like that, does the same thing. It goes up and over. And it's almost like this piece here was there to accommodate it like this here. See that? That's that's kind of bizarre, man. That's cool. And, of course, we've got the enhanced right here. Try to get more of a natural color here for you guys. Check that out. What is that underneath this item? It almost looks like carved out hieroglyphs or something like that. See that? What do you guys make of that? And, of course, we get these objects in the back like I just showed you. One, two, three. Got this piece right here completely straight out. Looks like it comes down and holds this piece up right there. See that? Not sure what to make of that. And, of course, we get this completely blurred out right there. I don't know. You guys tell me what you th think this stuff is. Again, thank you to Sib Sibby, uh, I believe is the name, as well as Keith Murdoch. Thank you guys for submitting this stuff. You, you guys get full props on this. This is not my work. This is, again, Sib Sibby's as far as the moon stuff, which is, again, right here. I'm just going to bring the whole thing over to you guys. Okay. And I'm also going to give you the links to it so you guys can check those out as well. I got them all right here. You guys can check out the links that uh, they had provided. So big thanks to Sib Sibby for that. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. And, of course, you know, this is uh, their work right here. These moon photos of C C Copernicus Crater. And up close right here. Now, this one here wasn't Copernicus Crater. Not sure which one that one is, to be honest with you. Uh, and it really doesn't matter at this point. But all the links will be given you guys as usual. Um, and the other one here, I'm not so sure of as far as Keith. Uh, he's got it on 1348 is the Sol. You can see it up here. I got it. I put it down there. That's one he told me it was at, uh, what Sol it was. So, you know, I'm going to try to have a look at that before you know, I post a video. Or I'm going to, uh, I'm going to post a link right after I put the video up. So I'm going to try to make sure I got that for you guys. Anyway, guys, tell me what you think. What are we seeing here? You know, between the moon photos and Copernicus Crater, these objects are there. I know you guys have seen this photo a million times, at least the one that the whole the whole crater. To me, some of these things are just crazy, the things that we're seeing in this uh, in this crater. And like I said, I mean, we've all seen that particular photo. But And when you break it down and look for the lines, you find you find shapes. You find things that don't belong there, right? Um, and that other one which shows the crater, just a small piece of the crater wall, and what's behind it or on the outside, on the ground itself, that was amazing when you bring out the lines and everything that's in that photo. Comment down below, guys. Let me know what you think. And don't forget to share the video, guys. Always appreciate it. You guys know that. And, of course, give me the thumbs up and like it. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Enjoy your weekend. And I'll see you on Sunday. Have yourself a good one. And I'll see you on the flip side.